Hello and welcome back to another episode of Stefan's Base Blog. That's not a base. Shut up. Anyways, today we have the Cremona Cello. Now, uh, this was pointed out because it was sitting right here in the background of my videos and uh, somebody wanted me to show it. So, let's get started. Looking up at the top, we have the nice scroll and the wood tuners. I hate these. And then moving down to the neck, you just got that nice flat neck. It has some tape on it for markers because uh, I'm stupid. Coming down, we got the nice wooden bridge. Then down here, we got the string holder and the fatty body because cello. So let's hear what it sounds like. Pizzicato. So yeah, it's a cello. I honestly know very little about cellos. Uh, I'm just gonna put that out there right now. So I'd say this is on the lower end of the cellos because this is definitely not a $50,000 uh, concert cello where, you know, let's bow. Get it? Cause it sounds like go. Now this is the part of the show where I suck at bowing because I have never been able to bow. <laughs> If you could hear past all the horrible garbage playing, it sounds pretty good. I mean, it's it's got uh, fancier strings on it than it would have came with. So, that's cool. Uh, so let's get into the pros and cons of this cello. It has a lump in the neck. So, don't want to play in this area. That's, no. So, is really good. It's a cello, I don't even know freaking where you'd buy this. <laughs> if you find one of these, if you happen upon the, what's it called? The Cremona cello, and you're in the market for one and you see it just chilling in a pawn shop, uh, pick it up. I, I'd say it's good for beginner, because it's definitely a, not freaking Mozart, Beethoven, Bach. Now, this has been Stefan's bass play. Thank you for watching and tune in next time for whatever I make a video of.